Hey guys, so today we're going to be making a little treat for Valentine's Day. They're going to be these little heart-shaped cherry pies and we're going to put some frosting on it and some sprinkles and they're adorable. So yeah, let's get started. So here in this bag I have some pie dough that I made a while ago when I last made an apple pie. So if you want to know how to make this dough from scratch, you can look at my how to make an apple pie video and I'll put that up on the little eye bar that'll pop up on the top right corner. So yeah, just click on that and it will take you directly to my apple pie video and then you'll make the dough and then you'll come back here to finish this recipe. So all you'll need for this first part of the recipe is your pie dough and some cherry pie filling in a can. So now just roll out your pie dough and then take a heart shaped cookie cutter and start cutting out little hearts. Now put your hearts on a cookie tray with some parchment paper and then start scooping your cherry filling onto the pie crust and make sure you strain your cherries before putting them into the pies and then seal them together with your fingers. And then start using a fork to seal it together even more. Now I'm just going to brush my pies with an egg wash and to make this egg wash you just use one egg and you use two tablespoons of water and you mix that together. Now just brush all your pies with the egg wash. Now just take a knife and cut a little slit down the middle of each of the pies and this will create a hole and it helps it bake better. Now just bake these in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit or 244 degrees Celsius for 28 minutes or until the crust is golden brown. So now I'm going to make the glaze using my stand mixer and I'm mixing in one cup of powdered sugar and two tablespoons of milk. And then I'm just going to mix that up until it's all combined. Now I'm just taking some pink food coloring and I'm just going to add in one drop to get a nice pretty light pink. And these are our beautiful finished cherry pies and keep in mind that the glaze is a glaze, it's not a frosting so it's going to be very liquidy and very clear. So yeah, and then just put some sprinkles on top to make it pretty. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe because I post every Tuesday, and comment down below any questions or suggestions for what I could make in the future. And also, my social medias are down in the description, so go follow me. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye!